everyone, Alex here from TCO Fly Shop coming from you outside Boiling Springs, Pennsylvania. It's a beautiful spring day out today. Today we're going to talk about um, some questions we get in the, in the springtime this time of the year in the shop or uh, early in the mornings. It's still cold outside so a lot of our guys are nymphing or fishing small streamers and stuff like that in the morning and then uh, as it warms up through later part of the morning we start seeing our early spring hatches uh, i'm going to talk to you like i said that question i receive in shop a lot is uh, how can i really reduce the amount of equipment i'm carrying with me such as carrying multiple reels with me multiple rods with me and kind of put everything into one uh, perspective now, with nymphing around here uh, euro nymphing tactics european tactics tight lining uh, whatever you want to call it has become very, very popular the past couple of years, especially with more fishermen coming into to the game. Uh, so throwing your nymphing and then still needing to be able to cast with a dry fly set up later into the day. Uh, it used to be, you know, guys with tight line with just a really long leader. Uh, a lot of guys want to get into using the level lines now. Uh, before I used to carry just a reel that was a straight level line. Uh, so that kind of kept me, you know, kept me held up with trying to dry fly fish in in the later morning or if a hatch would pop off in the afternoon and every fish in the creek started looking up at that point. Uh, you know, you can definitely get your casting by, uh, but you're not going to be able to reach maybe a fish that's on the other side of the stream. Uh, so what I want to show you is the uh, Euronymphing kit from Scientific Angler here. Uh, it's a pretty awesome little kit. There's some other companies out there that have uh, products that are very, very similar to this. Uh, the one thing I like about this is it includes a, a uh, pre-made Euronymphing leader uh, for the guys who may be a newer angler, uh, ladies that may be newer, newer anglers, or just getting into, into that style of fishing. Uh, it gives you everything in one kit that you need to really get started with. Uh, so you don't have to worry about your own leader building and stuff like that. Um, it also gives you a nice little uh, foam rig keeper uh, kind of like the, the loon rig keepers is very similar. Uh, the nice thing is about this, you can take your whole uh, shorty, as you call it, you know, a short section, pony section. It's about 20 foot long. You can take that whole section off and wind it right up onto this and then put it in your vest or your pack or store it away for a, a later time uh, if you want to do some dry fly fishing with your regular fly line. So like I said, gives you the about 20 foot pony section of level line. Uh, it's going to be a 0.22 diameter. Also gives you a pre-made uh, leader uh, with indicator section on it, tip and ring, loop the loop connection, and then in the center here you have your foam rig, rig keeper. I'm going to show you my reel here. I have my reel already set up. Um, so I'm going to show you, I'm going to strip my leader off, get down to that 0.22 section. Here's the 0.22 section, that's about 20 foot long. And then I'm going to go into my regular floating fly line. Uh, this is all set up loop to loop connection. So now I have a regular, just a, a regular four weight floating fly line. So this allows me to just keep one reel on my rod, fish it uh, with a 10 foot rod. And then all of a sudden, if every fish in the river starts looking up, all I have to do is peel off that 20 foot pony section of level line, put it on the foam rigging indicator. You'll see there's a, a groove inside there reel everything up on there and then I can put it away in my pack, put a nine foot or a seven and a half foot regular five X or six X leader tie dry fly on and I'm fishing to a rising fish in less than five minutes. Or the bad thing about carrying that second reel with you was you had to take all of your line and take it down through the guides of your rod, reel it back up, take your whole reel off your rod, put it in your backpack, pull your second reel out, take all your line back up. So it's a real time saver to be able to keep all your line up through all of your guides and already have it out the top guide. And all you have to do is pull your, your pony section, 20 foot pony section out to your floating fly line and take that loop to loop connection off, wind it up quick and just take that nine foot or seven and a half foot regular uh, mono leader that you're gonna use for dry fly fishing and put it on. If you like this video, please subscribe to our YouTube channel. You can pick up this product at any of our TCO locations or at tcoflyfishing.com. Thank you.